Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Chemical Angel and no gaming video for today. Today's video at least. <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna be doing another um haul, I guess. But this time it's not any random haul, like the last time. It's gonna be a Hello Project haul, a special little Hello Project haul. So I received this package a few days ago. I was really really excited because this is all the stuff that I accumulated. Oh my god, how does how did I say that properly? These are all the stuff that I bought throughout the months, and I finally was able to ship it and stuff, or have my friend ship it. So, yeah, so all of this stuff is like from months ago, and it finally, I finally was able to ship it to me, and it came to me a few days ago, and everything is amazing. But other than that, um, yeah, so I wanted to show it off and share it with, with you guys, because I'm a big Hello Project fan, and I just wanted to talk about it more, and, and show you what I got. Other than that... Pretty much without further ado, let's just start the video. So, pretty much, I guess we can start with the figures. Because I did get a few figures. Um, most of these were pre-orders because they do pre-orders now for figures instead of how it used to be. So I bought all these figures. So I'm going to show it off to you right now. We got in, um, what is it? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we got six figures, which this one being the big one. So we can save this one for last, maybe. So we can do these first. So and first up is, this was last year's Christmas, Mizuki Fukumura from when we were saying 2-0, because now they're 2-1 now. So yeah, this, like I said, since I bought these months ago, this one's almost a year ago at this point, because this is a Christmas version. <laughs> but yeah, so I got this one. I really liked how this one, how she looks. She looks so pretty. I like the dress. And overall, yeah, like I said, Mizuki is always, you know, gorgeous. Um... And then my best girl, um, you know, my, my current Oshin Hello Project and all of Hello Project, which is Monica Inaba from Juice Juice. Um, this, I think, is from her, like, the pop music video. I think so, but I don't fully remember. But yeah, I really liked it. She looked really cute, so I just wanted this one. Yeah, Monica looking cute, as always. Um, the Go Me Beyond's commercial campaign that they had. My favorite girl in Beyonds is Kurumi. So this is her. Um, this is the only first ever figure I bought of her because she had, there's been there's been others released, but this is the only one I, I've gotten so far of her. So this is the first one ever. But yeah, this was part of the commercial campaign they had for Gomi, which was like the juice, I think it was. And they were like all dressed up like cheerleaders and a music video where they were cheerleaders. So they released a the stand. I bought, I got this one. So yes. Next, another Monica. I bought, I bought mostly Monica um, ones. The downtown music video one, which came out earlier this year. I just really like um, the outfit. I love this the ju the Juicer's outfit for downtown, which I just like the, their business suit aesthetic that they had. I just really, really like it. So when I saw this one, I was I was like, I know I had to have this one because besides the fact that, you know, I, I you know, she's my favorite in Juice Juice and, and of all of Hello Project, but... Um, my current Hello Project, because Zuki is my forever Oshi, forever coming Oshi. But yeah, she, I just really wanted this one. So that's why I went for it. But yes, look at her. And her little, like, button shirt and tie and everything. She's just, just so cute. Next, the next. Um, this is also from last year's Christmas. Um, the Monica in about one. So this was the Christmas one from last year. She has like a little like reindeer outfit in a way, or like you know aesthetic outfit. But yeah, of course she looks so adorable like always. Okay, so the last one, which is the big one, I put it to the side here. But yeah, so it's already kind of ripped, sadly, because you know um, since my names were here, some of them had my names on it, so I had to take them off because I don't like to really show off my name like that. But yeah, so when I took off the name, it freaking ripped it up a little bit. So instead of leaving, I might I might not leave this in the pocket. I actually use the stand and put it somewhere, but I'm not too sure yet. So I'll decide whenever. But yeah, so this is the this was the next generation 10th anniversary event figure stand. So earlier this year, Mizuki and Erina um had their 10th year. They they celebrated 10 years in Morning Mystery, which is crazy considering I've been a fan of. Morning Mystery Hello Project for like 12 years, no, 13 years now at this point. 
and the fact that I've been, I've, you know, they've been around for 10 years and I've been here still, it's so crazy to see them evolved, how they, you know, grow up and everything between, you know, but yeah, so this is crazy, but yeah, this is the little figure stand, I thought this was so cute, I love the color scheme because, you know, they have their member colors, but yeah, this is so cute and nice, and I really wanted this, so I got this, but yeah, this is so cute. So that's it pretty much for the figure stands and then let me put these to the well it's already on to the side but let me put them more to the side so we can make space um what else do we do we get oh yeah photos photos where are the photos i have to put them to the side so i can make have space here photos um so we got how many we get like five one two three four five six we got six photo sets so we got six here and of course like this one these three are all part of the same event which was of course the ninth generation 10th anniversary event like the figure stand this also was part of the event sets that um goods that they had so i bought the erna um, 2L set, the Mizuki 2L set, and then I bought both of them together, 2L set, so the duo, so I haven't even opened these yet, so you get, you're just going to see the first picture of it, so look at Erna, and then the duo together. And then Mizuki. Look at all the hearts that she have. That was all I like. I just noticed that she has the hearts of the, the other member colors, you know, Riho and Zuki. You can see them, which is nice. So yeah, those three are part of the, the 10th year event. And then these two were part of, um, this was Chisaki's birthday event that came, that was earlier this year. So happy birthday to her. Even though I was saying happy birthday really, really late. But yeah, this was Chisaki's um, L set and then two L set celebrating her birthday. I really love this outfit on her. It was so adorable. I thought it was the cutest thing. And I was like, oh, I really needed to get it. I was I was thinking about skipping it. But then I was like, nah, I, wanted, I really needed to get it because I thought it was so cute. So, yep, just these two. Next. This is the only, it's not the only else that I got, but this is just the most ra like normal else that I got because you know, everything else was uh, fan club exclusive. And this one was like the only one that's from the actual shop that you can get. So this is the, just a Monica L set that I just really thought it was cute. I really wanted it because I saw it on, you know, on the online. I was like, oh, I really wanted this. It was so, so adorable for her. So this was the only normal L set because everything else was fan club. All this was fan club exclusive. So yeah, so it's just Monica. So pretty much same thing. We got some photo sets. I haven't bought as much as I usually do, but I have I have been slowing down on my Hello Project purchases. So, but you know, this is a nice little haul that you have. So yeah. Next up, um, also part of the 10th anniversary event, the 9th generation 10th anniversary event. These big fans. <laughs> oh God. We're going to show the first one. The big fans or, you know, these are called Uchiwas in Japan. But this says 9th generation, 10th anniversary. This is for their event. This is Arena. And look at it. It's pretty huge. I'm not too sure how the camera is going to take it. Maybe I have to raise it up a little bit. But yeah. So this is how it looks. Says her name, look how beautiful she looks, her hair, and everything. So this is Erina in the back. Doop. Yeah, so I don't typically buy these type of goods. Usually I buy like photos and figure stands now or like you know pinups, but this is I don't buy like these um Uchi was fans like ever. I only have like three in my collection, and these are the first two that I've bought in years. So, I don't think these are probably the first and only for a while I'm ever going to buy. So, yeah. So, next up is uh, Mizuki. 
So now you can see her now. It says the same thing on the bottom. Has her knee. She's doing the little heart um, poses, like hands uh, poses. I don't know what it is. I don't know how to say it. I'm awkward. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to put the camera up. So you can see how it looks. And then the back. Boop. All the heart member colors are there still. yeah so those are the two fans for the event i literally splurged mostly on the event because i like i said um the I'm generation of morning racing is my favorite generation of morning racing um suzuki kanan which is zuki she is my forever kami oshi she will oh i will always she will always be my oshi but yeah but yeah, so that generation is, is my absolute favorite, and the fact that these two celebrated 10 years is so crazy, and I wanted to buy, I pretty much bought almost all the goods, except maybe, like, the shirt, and I think they had a tote bag. So that's pretty much it. So we did photos, figures, and, um, and, um, the Uchiwa. So next up is the CDs. I haven't bought that many, to be honest. I only bought in three, and I still have them in the wrapping, actually, so you, uh, you can hear me, like, literally taking this off now. So don't mind me. So I haven't even taken them out of the pl out of the plastic too, so you're gonna see which ones I have. So we got this one, which was Morning Musume's Two Zero's last single, which was literally at the end of last year. And I literally ordered this last year, and I, and I didn't get this until now. <laughs> so it's still in the plastic. I'm gonna have to take it out because we should. I'm gonna probably. Um, you know, they always have a random card in each single, so I'm gonna, like, unwrap this plastic, and then we can look at it together and stuff, so, you know, surprises. So, this is, um, the, the first CD that I got. This was, you know, a long time ago that I should have gotten. Um, next, Anger Me, Anger Me, Anjurumu, um, this was their latest single, which, and this was, like, Adeste Root A or B. This was, like, they had a Trooper A slide, and this was the song that I really in like, the most. So I went for this version. I think this was regular. I think this was version C, but I don't fully remember. But yeah, so still, still, you know, still in this plastic. We can also unwrap this and check the card out together. So make sure you guys can tune in for that. And maybe you can guess who I get out of these two. You can guess who I get and stuff. Next is the CD, but this is um an album which we got in um so so I oh my god why am I saying her name like wrong. Sayashi's Riho's is Riho's um, debut mini album, which is called Daybreak. Um, it came out last month, and I didn't plan on getting this when she first announced this, but then when she put up previews of two of her songs before this came out, I was in love with it, and I was like, nah, I really want to get this album now. And you know, she's also a former she's a former Ninth Generation member, which you know, like I stated, Ninth Generation is my favorite generation. And, you know, she really, you know, she recently started, you know, coming back to business, to the entertainment business and everything. And I was surprised that she's, you know, decided to release an album. So she released this album, this mini album, and I, I decided to pick it up. I, I decided to get it. I wanted to support her. I really, like, enjoy the songs. So it's still in the plastic. I haven't even taken it out yet. So this is just her. This is Riho. And then the back has the songs. There's only five songs in it. But yeah, this is really nice. So yeah, I wanted to support her. Congrats, Rio, on your little de debut mini album. Hopefully you release new, um, more songs and stuff. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's go um, pretty much take these plastics off and, you know, let's see what card we get. Okay, the plastics took a while for me to actually get out a little bit. So we're going to do the CD first, which is the... Morning anyway, Wizard so One. This one came out first, you know, since this was like, out last year. So we're gonna do this one first. You can see the, you can look at the cover more better now. All the girls. And then we open up. Oh. No, we didn't even see the back. It's just simple. Yeah. It's just like a brown, simple thing. But yeah. And then, of course, the other, um, single outfits from the song okay look at it it's popping up 
So let's see what we can guess um, out of out of the rest. For me personally, I would want um, Riho, Riho, Rio, because I'm thinking Riho like her, like you know, so she. But yeah, new, new, new 15 generation, 15 generation Rio, um, Mizuki, Arena, and who else? I think that's about it. Maybe Chisaki and Kaidi because they are like my favorites too. They're becoming like these five. I think are like on my top five right now. So I would say out of those five, I want the like those. So Mizuki, Arena, Chisaki, um, Kaidi, and Rio, Rio. And let's see what we get. So should I close my eyes? No. So it's an orange card and. Oh, we got a Kane. Uh, I kind of, damn. <laughs> I don't want to sound so bad, but like, she's not my favorite. She was like never my favorite. So it's kind of dis slightly disappointing that I got her. But you know, she's, it's still okay. I'm not going to be like, well, I'm, I'm going to be super angry and throw this out just because it's not the favorite. But like, nah. But yeah, you can see how she looks. She's been, she's grown into an amazing singer though. Surprisingly, like in the Hello Fest, like the solo Hello, Hello Solo Fest too, she, yeah, she's so great now compared to how she was when you know, of course, when you're younger, you're not gonna be amazing, but yeah, she's so much more. She's so much. She's grown so much and everything. Like it's crazy. So congrats to her, Connie, for just growing up, singing. Um, her singing has improved and everything. That's pretty much it. So okay, so that's what we got. We just got a Connie from this um, single. And now we go next to um, Anger Me's one. So you can see clear. And back, it's just a bright like pink or red, depending on how you look at it. <laughs> okay, so we should be getting something. Oh, no. There you are, hiding more. Okay, so who do I want? I think I would want is um, Ayano, um, Rikako, and who else? Oh, Le Layla. She's been she's been so great too. I've been like these three are probably becoming my top three, and and, and Akari because she's been like she's been like my favorite for a while too. Like I would say he's my second favorite. But I've been kind of leaning towards these more, like these girls more. So, but yeah. So I would say out of those, all I thought of them, I would go for those four. I like the nice red card or pinkish card, whichever one you want to look at it. So, and Jinmu, and let's see what we get. Upside down, up, back, and upside down. Oh, this is the new, one of the new girls from. What was her name? Oh no, I don't remember her name. Uh, like Xion? I think that was her name. Cause I know the this one's Wak Wakana. I think that's her name, and then the other one is like Rin. So I think this is Xion. I think that's her name. Look at her. I got one of the new girls. I got a, I got the new girls date. Like these are the, the girls' debut singles. So it's kind of I guess it's a special moment to get a a, de a debut single like girls' debut single pretty much. Wait, okay, but she's so cute. All right, we we'll put this back now. <laughs> put it back so it can be safe. Um. Anyway, so that's it for my little Hello Project um haul. So thank you guys so much, so 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 much for um tuning in and, ch and watching this video. Um, to see what I think about you know showing off the, all the Hello Project goods I bought. And that's pretty much it to this video. I, like I said, I haven't been buying much Hello Project lately. But, you know, I really still enjoy listening to them, watching their stuff. And sometimes if any goods that pop up that really, really interest me, I would totally go for it. So, yeah, these are all the stuff that I bought literally accumulating over the months. So, I'm going to have to put them here and everything. So, you can see them all over again. Boop, 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 boop. Yes, these are all the stuff I uh, pretty much accumulated over the months. And some stuff that are on the side, but I can't bring it to the screen. But other than that, that's pretty much it. 
Um, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching this video. Um, hearing me talk about Hello Project and how much I, you know, love them so much and and stuff. But yeah, um, if you guys like this video, like and subscribe to the channel if you guys would like to. And next video would just be me gaming, like always. Anyway, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching and bye-bye. Hey guys, so after filming my Hello Project um, haul video, I forgot that I actually got some other goodies that came in the same week as that package and I wanted to show it off to you guys because I actually forgot to show it in the video. So this is just an add-on to the video. So anyway, so my good friend Kelly um, sent these to me because I bought these from her, which so thank you again so 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 much Kelly from the UK for sending these to me. So earlier this year Hello Project did, uh, for their tours, they did a MOBA gacha um, theme. Not theme, but like a thing. So gachas are usually where you spend a lot of money, you get whatever the hell they give you because it's always randomized. So this time, so Hello Project did this for the very first time because I don't think they ever did this before. But yeah, so you don't know what member you're going to get. They were selling badges, keychains, um, stickers, some, some um, rarest, the rarer ones or like posters and all that. So, but yeah, so a lot of people in the Hello Project community, you know, did this um, mobile gacha and then... Whoever, you know, people, not everyone's going to get their um, favorite members. So most of the community tends to um, decide to sell which ones they didn't want and to give it to other people who are, you know, fans of those members and all this and that. So she was selling these because, you know, and all that. So I was I decided to buy these from her because I really wanted it and I don't really participate in those um, gadgets. So, yeah, so thank you so much to her. And I just wanted to show off what I got from those. So I only bought, only bought four things. So I'm going to show you off really quickly. So... This is the first one. This is a little Mizuki sticker. It comes with two stickers. So this one is just a picture of her. And the second sticker is, um, what is it? It's her name. It just has her name on it. Apparently it says it's a rainy version. So I don't, I don't know of what other version they had of this. But yeah, these are apparently, the, um, these comes with two stickers. So this is just a little sticker of Mizuki. Um, we got this. We got a Chisaki badge. I don't buy much of Chisaki goodies, even though she's one of my favorite members. Of more amusement, but I don't buy that much goods of her. So I was like, okay, let me buy this because I really like her. So this is the Chisaki badge. Next, we got a Mizuki badge. I really like her hairstyle on this. It's cute. I'll put this here. And then the last one is a Chisaki keychain. I really like the styling of the keychain because it's, it's a little like, you know, a Sakura a flower. I really like it. And then she, she saw it just looks so cute here. And then it says Morning Wisdom at 2-1 in the bottom. And that's just how it is. So yeah, so these are the four items that I got. You know, two Mizuki and two, two Chisakis. So yeah, this is all I bought from Kelly. You know, like I said, thank you so much to Kelly. And that's pretty much um all the, all the, all, pretty much the whole Hell Project haul. So anyway, bye-bye.